Hey everybody, it's Mama TK Reviews. Welcome back to my channel. And today I have something delicious. But first, let's get into this video. Hey everybody, what's going on? It's Mama TK, so sing along. We do challenges, reviews, and mukbangs. That's what we got going on today. Yeah. So friends and family, we have some um, wings that I made. These are honey um, barbecue wings. And here I made me some potatoes, um, fries. I call them um, sour cream and nacho fries, potatoes. Um, let me tell you guys what I have in them. I, ha I cut the potatoes like this. I put cheese on them. Mm. I don't even before I can finish telling y'all. I'm gonna stop I'm just ready to dig in. I got a cheddar um sausage, a smoked sausage, the ones that had the cheese in it, some sour cream, and some onion. I got my water. I got some dip just in case I want some ranch for my um, wings. And I have a pack of towels. And I'm ready to dig in. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, everybody. I hope everybody's having a good day. I'm going to give y'all a few minutes to go ahead and get y'all food. Well, no, I'm going to give you a few seconds. One, two, three, four, five. So I guess everybody should be ready for us to go ahead and have this delicious dinner. Y'all see them fries? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Go ahead and grab y'all one. Mm, mm mm These are good. I like when I cook at home and make stuff. Because you can tailor it to the way you want to eat things. And how you like it. I hope y'all be able to see it good. I should have had some under him, but I ain't got nothing to put on here, y'all. But um, next time I'll make sure I do. This is good. I know some of y'all like, why she ain't got no fork? On your fork. We're gonna talk, but I'm gonna eat first. I'm hungry today. I'm gonna be like, girl, you be hungry every time. I know, right? By the time you finish preparing the food, I don't think I'm gonna do it. Grill. Just grill. Mm, 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 mm. I'm gonna put some sour cream on it. Let y'all taste another bite. Yep, yep, yep. Mm. So, y'all, yesterday, I was sitting back thinking, my son had called me. My son was in the army. And he was talking about um, how. There was a crisis going on with them swale. He said, you know them people ain't got no food down there, they hungry. I said, y'all heard about? And he said, um, we might have to go down there. I said, well, I pray y'all don't have no bad computation. I said, those people don't have weapons. They're just hungry. They, they're looking for help. Because they're in a dictatorship country. And it's bad that people have to live like that. Because here it is. I have way more than I can eat. And they down there hungry because of their government. And then our president saying, no, they can't come here. 
And it's heartbreaking. Because what what are they supposed to do? We're a close country here and we're supposed to help everybody. We're supposed to be a loving melting pot. Mm. 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 But it all goes back to where the Bible talk about in the last days don't be fooled with sources. People be lying dead in the streets. And you know, a lot of people try to discredit the Bible. Because there are so many people who make their own version of the Bible. But for the most part, we are adults. We are able to decipher what is fact and what is fiction when we pick up something and read it or when we hear something from somebody. Because we try to look at reality and what's going on and we try to look at um, you know, factual evidence. You know, that's what the Bible says. And I don't care who get mad at me about this. Excuse me. But the Bible hadn't failed on that one at all. That's the truth. We are in a time period where nobody cares about nobody. Diseases are flourishing more now around the earth than ever before. Mm. And I know people say, oh, well, that's because people have migrated from one country to the next. True. No, the Bible didn't have to necessarily say that, but the Bible did speak about how people were dictating from one country to the next. You know, one kingdom will rule, the next kingdom will rule. And what the dang talk about a lot of kingdoms and rulership. Mm. Good. Ooh, these onions, y'all know. What the sour cream and cheese and meat and really baked like potato for my not true. Mmm. It's gonna look like nacho. I pray that the situation is handled soon. And the people can get back to eating and taking care of their kids and going to work and having a roof on their head. It's getting hot. Storms are going to come through. It's just a bad situation all the way around. This earth is big enough for everybody. Everybody should have a place to stay. Food to eat. Clothes on their back. And for all those people who don't like to read the Bible, pray to God about it. Because I ain't telling you to wake up tomorrow and run to a church because it has to be in your heart to want to serve God. Hell, I'm going to be straight. I'm going to be like, you can take the wings and eat them on the table. I know, but they're so good. Mmm. Y'all, I'm drinking my water again. Mmm. Shout out to Taste the Moot Mall Eats for starting it, a lot of us on the Gallon of Water Day Challenge. And um, if you want to do this challenge, just mention in your video or at home um, that you're doing the water, gallon of water challenge by Tasty Mukbang Eats for 30 days. 
excuse me, but I'm trying to drink my water every day. Past 30 days, because I need to. Water is very healthy for our body. It has plenty of minerals in it that we need. And yeah. Okay. Let me get to this wing. It's not real spicy. It's not spicy hot. This is like, um, it's just honey mustard, um, barbecue flavor. Mm. I know I'm not going to eat all the wings. I'm more into this than the wings right now. I need some wings and all that. Mmm. Mmm. Mm. I feel like a fool inside my mouth. You remember they were doing trying not wipe your mouth, Charlie? I was feel miserable. Mm. Mm. That's good. Mm. Mm. Woo. It's crispy too. I'm glad y'all decided to join me today. I'm going to give a shout out to everybody who left me some nice comments yesterday. Who said they were praying for me. I appreciate everybody. I love you all. Thanks for being considerate of what I'm going through at this time. And we all need that because you never know who's going through what. I couldn't even win myself. Ugh. I'm sticking like two. Mm. But I'm getting full, y'all. I'm gonna have to save something for another meal. I had more than I could eat. Man, my kids want to eat something. Mm -hmm. Woo! Need to taste so good. I appreciate y'all for coming. And I saw the comments where my few of y'all discussed the spicy noodle challenge. I'm going to do it. Again, I don't know what damn day to post it. But look forward to it next week. That's when I'll be doing it. I ain't gonna spice news out while I'm running. 
I'm talking about the real spice noodle. Mm. And we made it this far in the video. Leave me some comments down below. Team TK. I want you to type in Team TK up in this building. Yeah. I love all of you guys so much. Mm. Peace and have a blessed day.